is it too late to become a programmer, like a successful software engineer? Answer is no, not really. It's actually never too late to start becoming anything in life, really. And the real reason you would want to become a software engineer should not just be because software engineers can make good money. Yeah, we can if you get good at it. But how do you actually become a good software engineer? How do you actually become good enough that it's worth doing? You have to enjoy writing code. You have to enjoy being a programmer. So is it too late to learn something that you might enjoy? No, absolutely not. It is never too late in life to learn something that you might enjoy. Um, especially, you know, as a, if you like programming or if you come to enjoy programming, then yeah, it sort of doesn't matter how many amazing opportunities there are out there for it, because if it's something that you really love and enjoy, you know, there's never a bad time to learn how to do that. You know, the best reason to actually become a programmer is if you test it out, if you try it out and you love doing it, then you should become a programmer. Then you should become, get into software engineering. That is the best reason to do it, period. The, the hard thing I've seen is that despite what you see in boot camp advertisements and stuff, I've never actually met anyone who just woke up one day and said, I'm going to be a programmer. And then like two or three months later, they're making a lot of money as a programmer and they're really good at it. There's a few people maybe who will study like 50 to 100 hours a week for months to become really good at something. And then they get that position and then they work their butt off and then, you know, on and on and on. But guess what? You've probably seen in life the kind of person who gets that kind of level of commitment to anything finds a way to succeed. For most people, though, it will take years to develop the skill of programming. It may or may not be a great career move unless you're wanting to uh, basically invest the next five to 10 years of your life doing it and to really like shift in that kind of a way. And I don't mean that it takes five to 10 years to find some level of success. I'm saying to get to a certain level of competence, you have to be able to invest years of your life into doing this. And so later on in life, it becomes harder for people to want to make that investment in themselves or in a new skill. You know, it's like if you're a black belt in Taekwondo and you're like a sixth or seventh degree black belt, picking up jujitsu at age 70 for some people would be really exciting and some people would be horrifying and terrible because it'd be like they have to learn everything all over again. And some people like being a sort of white belt and, you know, starting from like some people love the beginner's mindset and some people hate it. And so, you know, picking up a skill like software engineering, programming, coding, whatever you want to call it, uh, picking that up later in life, it's really going to depend on your mindset more than you know, whether it's possible, like it's absolutely possible for anyone learning the, like anyone watching this video to learn to code. You can absolutely do that at any time. It's never too late to learn to code as long as you really want it.